Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video, as you can see, by the title, I'm going to be doing a room tour, so um, let's get right into it. Sorry to interrupt, but I also want to say I did finish this video about five times, so I do apologize if I rush through this, so now, let's get right into the video. So right here, I have this keep out sign, um, I had it for a couple years, so I never put it up, and now that I got it on my door, um, yeah, it's just here. And then right here, I have a mini hoop, um, I don't use it that much, I think the basketball is somewhere under the bed, I have no clue, but yeah, I have a little basketball right here. Then behind my door, I have this foldable chair. Um, as you can see, I don't have that much space in my room besides like this spot right here. But um, um, I just don't use it and I don't have guests either, so yeah. Then going around my entire door, I have some LED lights. I have it going around this door, that door, and um, around my desk right there. So I'm probably just gonna go over this door right here. But these are like 16 feet. I think these are smart lights. Like smart, like RGBIC. That's what I meant to say. Um, RGBIC, each individual um, little light thing can produce its own color, which make a bunch of cool effects like this instead of having the whole LED script one color. So, definitely recommend RGBIC if you get LED lights. Then, right here, well, actually, right here, my light switch or my um, light, as you can see. I never use it because I got so many LED lights in my room. Uh, I just you know, turn on lights and works the same. And then right here, I have my TV. This is a um, smart TV. I think it's like 55 inches and it's 1080p. I just have like this fireplace plan. Um, I don't like, I don't really use the TV. Well, I do use TV, but um, I'm not using it right now. I just turn it on for the video, but I'm probably turning it off right after this. So yeah. Then right here, I have a flood light, which makes the RGB around my TV. Um, I actually lost the batteries of the remote. I just got it today. So yeah, that's a good thing. Then under my TV, I have a rug. I'm gonna like buy a new rug because I don't like this one. It gets dirty quick and I just want a new one. So yeah. Then over here, I have my dresser. Basically all this is my clothes and then pile of school work, a bunch of plants, fungal pops, and then a bunch of other stuff. And then right here I have some candles, which I'm currently using right now. This one I'm using, uh, if we can focus. If we can focus. Yeah, this is the one I'm using right here have two other ones right here um uh i don't know this is a perfect time to buy candles perfect years like around like fall and winter really good time to buy candles and i definitely recommend them make sure room smell good and looks better i guess i mean it's pretty small so i don't know if you're gonna take that much of that but um yeah it smells good so i definitely recommend candles then over here i have some more LED lights on this door this door leads to nothing um i think i don't i don't really know but um yeah then right here I have my closet and now yes these are curtains closet doors like hundred twenty dollars um this for my room and it have like other closets in the house so I have to wait until um, I get a closet door so then I just got uh, curtains and it works the exact same as a regular um closet door so yeah then right here um, this is temporary but I have my shelf right here so, um, I haven't put it up yet it's gonna go to the setup um so yeah by the time well um i don't know i think by the time you see this video it should be up already but this video is gonna be, well not this video but um me unboxing this was well, already involved <laughs> me on uh, setting this up it's gonna be in a separate video which i will see like around christmas somewhere around that but um yeah right here i have a fan um everybody has a fan in their house right if i'm guessing but yeah i have a fan and then i have trash can right here i have my mirror with some lights going around it um yeah, I, I really don't use this mirror. Right above that, I have a um, custom custom clock with my name on it. Uh, yeah, I, it don't even work. I just took the batteries out of it. So yeah. Then right here, I have my um window with my blackout curtains, more curtains, and of course the blinds. And then right under it, I have my bed. It's a full size bed. So uh, yeah. Then over here, we have the setup. Everything in the setup will be linked in the description. Besides the desk, the chair. In these two posters and yeah so uh, let's get right into this uh, right here at this extent eat sleep and repeat poster oh uh, yes I know the saying is kind of cringe but uh, I don't really mind so yeah I just have it and it matches the in my room so yeah right here at this go be glide um I think it's like a hundred dollars on Amazon but I got on sale for like fifty dollars so yeah that's more like fifty percent off um, pretty bright i think i have it on like the brightness on like 18 so yeah it's, it's really big and really bright then right here i have my monitor so i'm gonna just go over the main one the main monitor because um they're both are the same thing so yeah 
Um, the main monitor is the Asus 144 hertz, one millisecond response time, 1080p, 23.8 inches. Um, it's a pretty good monitor. It is kind of, it's like, it's pretty, like, it's pretty expensive. It's like $280 and $300 with taxes, but luckily I got both of these on sale. So I think, like, on sale I got it for like $220 or $230, something like that. But yeah, um, pretty good monitor. Uh, it says 144 hertz, and yes, I have it for both of them. So yeah. Then holding up the monitors, I don't even know, like, the name of this monitor mount. Um, I put like a picture of it on the screen, but um, yeah, it's just like minor amount. I got it on Black Friday for sale. Um, I think it's like usually like sixty something dollars, but I got it on sale for like thirty seven. So, um, yeah. You know, right here I have my microphone. Let me just pull it out. Um, when I'm not using it, I put it behind my monitor. Let's get out of the way. But yeah, this is the P5 Ampli Game E8. Um, you can see it has tap the mute right here. It has um, you can change the RGB. Um. With, I think it's the button at the back, but yeah, you can change the RGB. And it also has a volume knob as well. And yeah, I think it's a pretty good microphone. And right here, the boom arm. Um, I don't know the boom arm name either. I'm put it on the screen. This was originally for my blue snowball, but um, I did get a new um, a new microphone as you can see. So um, yeah, I, I want to get a new boom arm, but um, yeah, I just don't know which one to get. So um, yeah, I just got this one. And then. Um, let me see. I have my uh, speakers. I don't know what these call. I'll also, also put these on the screen, but they come with two speakers, a uh, subwoofer, and if I can get it, the controls is like right there. And it's a pretty good um, speaker. Um, I like it. It's pretty loud. Uh, you can hear it throughout the whole house. So, um, yeah. Right here, I have my um, mouse. This is the HyperX Plus for a haste. It's wireless, it's two grams lighter than a G Pro Super Light. So um yeah, I think it's definitely like a competition. Um I I've never had the G Pro Super Light before, so I don't know, but in my opinion, it's a really good mouse. It has RGB on the scroll wheel, it has honeycomb, and it looks nice. You get this in black and white. And the glider's really good. Uh, I'm gonna show you. You can see the glide's really good. You can do a 360 test. Yeah, it's like a really good glide. And it also come with grips on it, but I took them out because I didn't like how they felt. But um, yeah, it come grips on like two clicks thingy, and then on the side of the mouse. So yeah. Then right here I have my keyboard, it's Dyra DK61. Uh, it's a pretty good keyboard, 60%. Um, I don't recommend 60% keyboards because you don't have your arrow keys. And arrow, without having arrow keys, it's kind of annoying. I have to press extra buttons. So I like to recommend arrow keys. Um, but uh, I think it come with brown switches. You can change the switches. Um. Uh, these are different keycaps. These are not the original ones. Um, but yeah, this is what it sounds like. It also comes like pre foam mounted as well. I'm sorry, I, I look horrible, bro. I gotta do it with my thing. Uh, yeah, that's what the keyboard sounds like. And then have a wrist rest right here. This is a Red Dragon wrist rest. It comes in different sizes. I decided for 60 for my keyboard. And yeah, it's nothing too much to say about that. Then right here, um, I'm hoping to upgrade the mouse pad soon, but hold on. Sorry for the interruption. My dog was trying to eat something off my floor. I need to clean up the back of my door, but um, yeah. Like I was saying, this is my mouse pad. This is a HyperX mouse pad. It's extra large. I'm hoping to upgrade in the future. But um, yeah, it's a pretty good mouse pad and pretty big. It's big enough for what I need it for. And then right here, my PC is Skystep Blade 2. Game PC. Yes, it's a free build. Um, the specs, it's like... Uh, a DPU is like a GTX 6050 CPU cooler is stock. I think the CPU is a um, Intel 10100F. I think. Um, I think the mother I don't even know what the motherboard is. Um, the power supply is gonna be right here. I think it's like 500 gigabytes of storage. Um, I have a SSD on top of my PC. I just never like plugged it up yet. I mean, I have, but it doesn't work. Uh, I think it doesn't work. I gotta see. But um, yeah. Here I have some fake plants. I have that fake plant, that fake plant, and that fake plant. Most of these came from Walmart besides that one. Um, but yeah, just fake plants. Um, then, let's see, what else? My headset. This is Turtle Beach Wallace headset. It's $100, so it's pretty pricey, but pretty good in my opinion. I think it's $100 because it's coming with a microphone, but um, I, I ripped the microphone off the um, thing, off the headset, so yeah. Um, let's see what else. Um, my ring light, it's a 12 inch ring light, it's pretty bright. Let me just turn it on to show you. 
All right, so we got that and then see make it brighter. All right, I'm sorry for the on like setting pauses on um, my dog. He's very active and uh, keep getting in trouble, so I just locked him up in the cage. So um, like I was saying, 12 inch ring lights, creek bright. Um, it come with different like color effects. I think it's like it's like really bright as you can see. Um, light up this whole corner pretty well, and uh, you can turn up the brightness and then turn down the brightness. You can change like the warmth of the light as you can see. I'm not even pressing button, but yeah, you can change the warmth of the light and turn the brightness back down. And I have this Lego car. I don't live in Texas, but I have this like little Texas. I don't even watch the team either, so yeah. Um, and then I have some AirPods right here, and then I have this level up poster as well, kind of match the theme, like I said, of my room. And besides that, I think that's it. Also, the LED lights um, behind my monitor, these are the same that's around the desk, but it's like 10 feet and it's like, it's not RGB IC, but yeah, it's the exact same, basically. And now, I think that is it for the room slash setup tour. Um, right here, it's pretty empty, I have nothing to do. This is my um, bed for my dog, but like I say, it's in a cage, so um, yeah. Besides that, I think. That is it for the room tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you smash like button, subscribe on notifications so you never miss out on another upload. I'll upload weekly. I'm starting to, I hope. Hope I don't disappear again like before, but um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in my next video. All right, so I'm in the middle of editing the video. As you can see, it's pretty late at night. Uh, it's also Christmas right now, but um, yeah, I'm in the middle of editing the video, and I also forgot to mention my rug. I got this rug from Walmart. It's a great rug, but since like it's dark, you can't really see. Uh, it's a really comfortable rug though, and I definitely recommend buying it. Like I said, I got it from Walmart, and it's kind of cheap. So, yeah. Now I already said the outro and all that good stuff. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.